Hey guys, today I installed a 480 gig solid state drive on my HP 15-AC143WM. Uh, I put Windows 10 on there off of a bootable flash drive. Uh, obviously I couldn't do that first. I went into settings, escape, and then into BIOS setting, switch over to boot options, and then you enable legacy mode. So you're able to uh, read off of bootable flash drives. Then you click on uh, F10 for boot menu. When you restart and you choose uh, the flash drive that you have your bootable operating system on. Once I installed Windows 10, everything was complete and I turned it on. I got that uh, boot device not found error 3F0 with this HP as well. Um, I thought I could do it like my other video, but uh, it didn't work out like that. So what I did was when I got that error, I control, alt, delete, when it restarted, escape, then went into uh, into boot options and I disabled legacy mode. Once I disabled it, I saved the settings and I tried restarting, same, it gave me the same error, then I control, delete, went back into the BIOS, re-enabled the legacy mode and once it restarted it asked me that uh there has been a change to your booting or something so i said are you sure you want to do this press these certain numbers plus enter to save the changes so i did that and once i saved the changes and what do you know uh windows my windows 10 is now finally finishing its update and uh it's gonna be working fine now so hopefully this helps you guys